Hi, everyone. If you're here, you're joining me for a jump in for Nog in the Fog. You may have already read the book by yourself. You may have joined me for a jump in. And now it's time to see if all of your practice has made perfect by doing a sentence about Nog in the Fog. Now, there's something I say to my class all the time and it is practice, practice, practice. Perfect. So hopefully today we'll get some perfect sentences. Remember, my turn, your turn. When it's your turn, if you could say it out loud, um, just so it's nice and clear and you can get it in your head, just so that when it comes to writing it, um, it'll make perfect sense. So, my turn. Nog jogs in the fog. 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 It's quite a long sentence we've got today. There is a tricky word in the sentence and I've popped the tricky word up here. Now last week I think I made a bit of a mistake and I think I made the tricky words green and they're not, they're definitely red words. So I think last week I maybe used my green pen by mistake. So today's tricky word is the. I'm going to leave it here so you can use it if you need to for a sneaky peek. But if you don't need to, then don't look. Don't have the sneaky peek and you try it by yourself. Okay, so the tricky word today is the. Nog jogs in the fog. Now, what do we need when we're doing our hold a sentence? What goes at the very beginning? Capital letter. Now, the first word I heard today was nog. So we need a capital N. Mm. Now, this is a tricky one that some of us maybe haven't practiced. So you might want to pause the video and have a little practice of the capital N mm before you start. Once you've done that, what's the next thing we need in our sentences? Nog, finger space, jocks, finger space, in, finger space, the, finger space, fog. We need some finger spaces. And just like last week, if you want to draw the success criteria at the top of your page, just as a reminder, you're more than welcome to. Capital letter N, finger spaces. What was at the end of our sentence? Show me the action. Ha! We need a full stop, don't we? So three things that I'm looking for today. Capital letter N, finger spaces, and a full stop at the end of the sentence. I'll pop this here just as a reminder. And again, you can use the tricky word N. Not the tricky word, the tricky word is the, just at the top. My turn. Nog jogs in the fog. Nog jogs in the fog. Okay, let's have a look at what we've got with me. Nog jogs in the fog. Let's check if I got the success criteria. Remember, this is your pink and green pen time if you've got it. Have I got a capital letter N at the start of my sentence? Have you got a capital letter N at the start of your sentence? If you do, find it and give yourself a little tick. The next thing, have I got finger spaces between my words? I do. Have you got finger spaces between your words? If you do, choose one and give yourself a little tick. Up next, have I got a full stop at the end? Oh, just, you might have to look quite closely. Double check, have you got a full stop at the end of your sentence? 
If you do, give yourself a little tick just above it. Today's challenge, can you find the words that rhyme? A few of you done it last week and you managed to underline them. I won't do it on my one, but which two words sound the same? If you got three ticks today, give yourself a pat on the back, two ticks, a pat on the head, one tick, a finger clap. See you next time.